Hey guys and guys, happy new year. So we're going to be printing the Echo Dot V3 UK socket mount by Nick Beam 88. Um, the problem with this mount is that when Nick Beam 88 first printed it, it wasn't great and the fins weren't strong enough to hold the Echo Dot. So what he recommends doing is doing the bottom half printed at 20% infill and the top half printed at 100%. So I'm going to show you how to do that in Simplify 3D. Okay, so we've got the model into Simplify 3D and what we want to do is split it so the bottom half can be printed at 20% infill and the top half can be printed at 100% infill. So you should have your process set up with the profile you want to use and then all you need to do is go up to Tools, Variable Settings Wizard and you'll see a red square appear. This can be moved using the, the little slider and this is where we're going to split the model. So we're going to split it at 36 millimeters. So as you can see, it will split it just above where the, the model sort of changes and um, because we want these supports to be really, really strong. So we're going to click add location and you'll see that appear here. And then we're going to click split process. And on the left hand side, you can see we've now got two processes. The process one dash one is going to be the bottom half of the model and the process 1.2 will be the top. So I'm going to go into this process and just check the infill percent. And at the moment it's 20%. I'm going to make it hundred percent and support material. I'd like it to generate, click okay. And then I'm going to go into process 1.1, make sure that's set to the 20%. And again, just make sure that generate support material is enabled. So I'm ready to prepare this for printing. We can just come down to the bottom and click prepare to print. You need to select all of the processes by clicking the select all button and make sure continuous printing layer by layer is also selected. Click OK. And you can see that's prepared the model and it's ready to print. So let's get this onto the 3D printer and get it printing. Okay, so this is the finished model. Um, came out alright, so the plug just slots in, although you feed the cable through first. And the plug goes through. The echo dot just fits in, it winds around. And it just plugs it in. Goes on like that. 